a sister. Ooh. Oh, just this two. Ooh. That's actually worth quite a bit. Okay. What? Ooh. Pickpocket chance is 15% higher. Yes! Yes! Please. Oh, yeah. A good bard knows that he should always end on a high note. And of course the wise man knows to quit whilst he's ahead. I tend to think of it as, don't push your luck, sunshine. And I think in this case, that is probably a good idea. That ring is going to make my life a little easier. It should make it somewhat less risky to pick those pockets. However, morning is about to arrive, believe it or not. It is about 4 a.m. I think we should leave these other shops for another day. Yes, I do. Okay, let's go. I do feel like I'm summoning a pet when I do that, but it is useful. Yes, it is. So, next stop, Whiterun. Now, the tasks I have in Whiterun are to change some numbers in the Bannered Mare, which I can probably get done during the day, and I need to sweep one of the manors for three items. I'm not sure whether I'll have to wait until night for that one. I also need to steal 500... Okay, are you the carriage driver? Ride? Yes, I do. Sorry to wake you. I do realise it's almost 5am. Uh, but I would like to go, and I would like to go now. Climb and back, and we'll be off. That took a little less time than I thought it would. It's actually only just turning 6 a.m., which probably means I'm not going to be able to use any of the shops here. I, I had a few items I wanted to sell, although I suspect many of them I will have to wait until I get back to Riften, due to their somewhat dubious ownership status. However, we'll see what we can sell. Okay, no, she's awake. Well done. It's Do I have good to see someone I can count on? Yes, you could count on me, I suppose. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? Uh actually uh, just deal in general. Oh, Maiden Loom Manor is actually just outside of White Run, close to Pelagia Farm. All right then, I tell you what. Let's sort out the uh, the issues we have here. We have a ledger to change and a few items to acquire. I may have to come back at night for that latter thing. Now, where would the ledger be if it was going to be? I see. This could be easier than I thought. Let's get that done. Okay. Why not? It's there. It's looking at me. It's inviting me. It's saying, please, feel free to empty me of Coppersmith's bar. I don't. Sweet roll. I doubt there's going to be anything of value here. We can just quickly check anyway. One never knows. Okay, now this is, see, this is one of the problems with randomly acquiring things. If you need to come back and randomly acquire them later on, there may be 
less of them. However, now, theoretically, there's no real reason why I can't be wandering around here, is there? No, there's not. Okay, who was, who was, okay, I forgot to tell you to stay where you were, didn't I? I should definitely do that. Stay where you are. What happens if I... Are you going to stay where you are now? Eye patch. Do I want an eye patch? Do you want an eye patch? Maybe you want an eye patch. Every little helps. Okay, Hulda. And not Hulda. Okay. Now, I do not think I'm going to pickpocket these people because it's a little... Okay, is she dead? She's staring right at me. Is she breathing? Are you breathing? Okay, she's got her eyes closed. Okay, tell you what. Let's not steal from the freaky lady that's lay there looking at us. Because that's just a little disconcerting. Okay, you know what? Let's go somewhere else. Are you, are you actually staying put? No, so that, that, that pretty much failed to get you to stay where you are. Right, okay, let's just run around and find a few things to pick up. Now, yeah, all of the shops are currently going to be, uh, Hello, so which ones have back doors and which ones are likely to have some valuable items so that I can uh, do what is needed and then be of... Ah, right, people are getting up now. This is going to be a little difficult, probably. There's no back door there. Now, there is a back door here. The question is... Okay, this is to Arcadius... Co okay, no, this is a bad idea. There is somebody there. I think what I should do... ...is get out of Whiterun. I still have a very small bounty here. Let's just get out and case the manor. And then we can come back a little later when it's a tad darker. I mean, you never know. Perhaps things I take from the manor will actually count towards taking from Whiterun. Is it Whiterun the city or is it just sort of the, the area around Whiterun? I guess we will find out. He just had that purposeful look about him. Yes, I've, I've become a little obsessed with picking flowers. Hmm. Why do I feel that in a previous life this has been an issue? Okay, so the manor should be here. Maiden Lou Manor. Yes, indeed. Ah. Jervar, Jervar, Jervar. Need a horse? Talk to my father, Skolvar. Oh, you work for the horse? That you, actually, I do want a horse. I just, um, you know, I was thinking that I should buy a horse from Solitude. They probably have the most noble-looking horses. Okay. Ah, oh, that's the uh, the the Caravaneers tent. Um. 
I cannot help but feel entering there when it is this bright is probably a bad idea. What do you think? Here's the thing. We've been up most of the night. We could just get a night's sleep and come back when it's a little less illuminated. Or we could just knock on the door and see if anyone's there. I mean, that's, that's always an option, isn't it? I totally forgot about that. Where are my manners? Hmm? I should introduce myself. Yes, indeed. Uh, hello? Ah. Nope. Going back to plan less illumination. Well, I guess the rain will actually make it harder to see me as I enter that building. But I can't help but feel it will also mean I leave behind a trail of wet, soggy footprints that can be seen and possibly heard. Oh, lightning. That could reveal me, couldn't it? And let's not forget the fact that this weather is going to play hell with my complexion. However, I guess we don't have much choice. Right. I will miss you. Yes, I will miss you too, but I don't honestly think you're needed in here. So, am I seeing any guards? No. No, I'm not. Now, I should probably knock and check if there's anyone in there. Oh, God. He says, missing the door. Okay, there's nobody here. I'm just a guy knocking on doors to try and avoid the rain. Okay. So. Okay. Nice. Now, there was no answer, but that does not mean... There is no... Shine. I wonder if that's one of the things I'm here to collect. Okay. Probably should find the major things first and also identify if there's anybody. Okay, that's not what I want to do. Yes, I'll tell you what. Let's go and wait. Oh, actually, I need that for good healing potions. Yes, I do. You know what I could do whilst I'm here? I could go farming. The idea is fairly horrific, but I could do with the wheat. Yes, I could. I will I will try to think of it, not as farming, but acquiring wheat at the source. Yes, indeed. So I have three specific things to find. Let's just make sure we get those. What is that? That looks like a railing for a set of stairs. Wish I could pull the rug back and find out. Am I hearing something? I don't think so. Jeweled pitcher. Nice. While I'm here. The firmament. We will check. We will, we will check everything. Assuming the coast is clear and we get the main items. I see more shiny. Okay. So, nobody's here. Nobody's here. Okay. Ooh, shiny. Now. This means I can actually <laughs> use a light, which is going to make life an awful lot easier. Yes, it is. I really would prefer a lantern, though. I mean, this thing, this thing, not only am I leaving wet footprints behind, I'm probably leaving soot on the roof. Now, I'm not saying I don't want to do that because I don't want people to know I've been here. Let's face it, they're going to know I've been here. 
I, uh, I just think I want to have been here, taken all their stuff, and not made a mess. It's, it's, it's just... I don't know why. It, it feels rude, really. You're breaking into somebody's house, you're, you're taking their valuables, which is perfectly reasonable, but... Getting muddy footprints on the carpets and ruining... Okay, I was going to say the paint, but... Whatever. It's just... Well, it's inconsiderate. That is what it is. Okay, so that is that, I believe. I think we're done here. Yes, we have got all of the tasks we need doing in, uh, in Whiterun done. However, as tempted as I am to just run off to Windhelm right now, because I would, I would, I would arrive at night, which would be very convenient. But I would also arrive drenched to the bloody skin, which would be, well, unpleasant. I mean, it, it's not that I'm against being efficient. I'm, I'm just more against having soaking wet underpants. Really? Really, really? Oh. Fine, I guess. I don't suppose you'd like to take me somewhere warm, would you? Well, at least the weather here is a little better. Cold, but somehow a lot more cheerful. Specifically, it's not raining and it's starting to snow. It's still pretty pleasant. You know what? We actually have something we need to do in this direction. We have a set of Daedric boots to acquire. Would you stop that? Every time I turn around to talk to you, you just run off and make me keep spinning around like a ballerina. Yeah, I believe it's along this road. The Shrine of Boethia. Now, ordinarily, I would not be too worried about visiting a shrine, but this is Boethia, I believe. However, it is a longer road, so it should be safe. The question is, would now be a good time to get a horse? I don't really fancy the idea of running around, certainly not in this cold. But a horse, well, that requires maintenance. And once you have a horse, it's difficult to take a carriage again because you leave your horse behind. It's not as though you can just whistle and the horse comes. You know what? Let's keep our eyes open for a pair of cloaks to fend off the cold weather and then perhaps wander out and check that shrine after we've cased this place. I'm assuming we're going to have to wait until night time to get what we've got to do done. And rather than just hang around, maybe we can take a stroll up there. Who are you and why are you staring at the door? Oh. I own Hollyfrost Farm outside the city. It's honest work, if a bit dull. It sounds awful. So, we have two things to do here. One, break into to a manor and take something. I can't quite remember what. And the other was to plant the stolen rough garnet in Brunwolf Free Winter's house. Yes. This one was retrieved the ornate drinking horn from Viola Giordano's house. Is that is that the house that we went into previously to return a ring. It was, wasn't it? I wonder if she's still there. I'm pretty sure it was her. And it was... Where was it? It was... Need something? No. 
Okay, a sewer. A convenient sewer house. Was it here? Viola Giordano's house. Okay. Ah, oh, the, the, there is a guard. Is there? Is there a? Um, is there a back door? I'll tell you what, rather than hopping around looking suspicious, why don't we uh, just wander around and take a peek? Is there a? No, it does not seem so. Okay. Well, I could return after du i tell you what, why don't we knock? Perhaps she's in there! Hello? No answer. Yeah, I'm not- I'm not too keen on breaking in. No, I'm not. It's a little... Like, I hadn't quite finished the sentence. I'm not keen on breaking in in broad daylight. It, uh, it would probably be a good idea to wait for the night time. Let's check the other place out. It was over on this side, and it was Brun... Brunwolf? Brunwolf or something. Brunwolf Free Winter's house. It was here. Okay. Oh, lots of good places to stand unobserved. Actually, you know what? This is... Okay, there's a guard down there. This is not particularly busy, is it? Okay, we've got a gentleman coming up here. Two people down there. Honestly, I don't think we need to wait for the night. No, I don't. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here, here, here. You stay here. I do sound a little silly, don't I? Uh, you stay here and keep guard. No, 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 no. Here. Here, here, right here, and shout if you see a guard coming. Here, come here, come closer. I will be here. Okay, good. There is a guard, and I. Okay. What are those two doing? Then it's true what everyone is saying that Aventus Artino is doing the Black Sacrament. Trying to summon the Dark Brotherhood? Oh! Rimba, always with the nonsense. No yes, I was not heard about that. Tales. Fine, then I'll invite him out to play. He lives right there. I'm going to knock on his door. No, child. Wait! That boy, that house, they are cursed. Ha! Then I'm right. I knew it. He's trying to have somebody killed. All right. I won't deny it, child. What you heard is true. But Aventus Oratino walks a dark path. His actions can lead only to ruin. Now, in or to the dark brotherhood. No I am the only friend you need. And I have to say, hello, I Idesa Sadri. Hello. I try to keep Grimvar safe, but these are dangerous times. Did I hear you say something about the accursed child? Mm, yes, it is quite sad. A young boy, Aventus Aretino, lost his mother recently and was sent to an orphanage. But he has returned home, and people have heard strange chanting. They say it's the Black Sacrament, the ritual to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Why Did they a little boy would want to contact exist? a group of murderers is beyond me. But he is inviting evil into this city. Safe travels. Right! So you're saying he might know how to contact? He might know how to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Because I have to say, 
I'd be slightly interested in making that acquaintance myself. And if he... Oh, that was nice. If he knows how... Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Oh, so, okay. very tired. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your Just child case. unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet uh -oh. mother, send your child unto okay. me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Grow on, you old crone. You'll get what you deserve. The Dark Brotherhood will see to that. Um, excuse me. Hello. Die, Grow on, die. This is Grow on, you old crone. really You'll very get what unhygienic. You the Dark Brotherhood will see to that. Nightshade, a kiss, sweet Please, mother. How long must I do this? I keep praying, Night Mother. Why won't you answer me? Okay, excuse me. You've come at last. I knew you would. Uh, are you all right? He says, knowing the answer to that question. It worked. I knew you'd come. I just knew it. Oh. You did the Black Sacrament over and over with the body and the things. And then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood. No, I was actually hoping you knew how to contact them. Uh, yeah, sure, Black Sacrament. It took so long, so very long. But now that you're here, you can accept my contract. Is, is that an actual human skeleton? And out of curiosity, whose is it? And where's the rest of the, um... Well, the meaty parts is what I'm getting at. Uh, contract. My mother, she... she died. I... I'm all alone Okay, now. is that her? So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften, Honor Hall. The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call her Grella the kind, but she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us. Okay. So I ran away. Don't and care. And came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here, and you could kill Grella the so kind. So you perform a Black Sacrament, and you, oh. So you, you think I'm... Innocence lost. Okay, you think I'm an assassin who's come to fill the contract and you don't actually know how to... Okay, you... A kiss, sweet mother. So you wish to summon the Dark Brotherhood? I might, yes. You wish to see someone dead? Frequently. Pray, child. Pray and let the Night Mother hear your plea. You must perform the most profane of rituals, the Black Sacrament. Create an effigy of the intended victim, assembled from the actual body parts, including a heart, skull, bones, and flesh. Encycle, encircle that effigy with candles. The ritual itself must then commence. Re proceed to stab the effigy repeatedly with a dagger, rubbed with the petals of a nightshade plant, while whispering this plea. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Then wait, child, for the dread father Sithis rewards the patient. You will be visited by a representative of the Dark Brotherhood. So begins a contract bound in blood. Well, apparently, it doesn't work, because all it managed to do was summon me. And I have no idea how to contact them. So basically, I'm no use to you, but more importantly, you are no use to me. Out of curiosity. Letter from Stuart, your life. Master Aventus Arantino, Jarl Ulfric Stormcloak, wishes to express his deepest sympathies at the death of your mother, Narlia. 
Unfortunately, because you are fatherless and have no other known relations, the Jarl cannot allow you to remain in your home unsupervised. Therefore, in no more than a week time, you are to report to Honor Hall Orphanage in Riften, where you will reside until your 16th birthday. The Adantino family home in the city of Windhelm will, of course, remain your property. The building will be securely locked and ready for your return six years hence. Note that I am unsure of the education provided to you by your recently deceased mother, or if you possess the ability to read the letter I am currently composing. Therefore, a member of the city guard will call upon you in one week at your home and provide escort to the orphanage. Hopefully, his arrival will not come as a complete shock. With greatest respect, your leaf, steward to our most noble Jarl, Ulfric Stormcloak. Okay. Well, that was a complete waste of my time, wasn't it? I'm... Taking this to make up, to make up for you wasting my time, child. Go to school, get an education. Better still, get an occupation. Okay, we're all clear on this side. Okay, brilliant. Let's do this. Oh. Of course, first of all, let's just check to see if anyone's home. No, nope, nobody's home. Right. So, plant the something here. I can't quite remember. Probably should check. Um, plant the stolen rough garnet in his house in Windhelm. The question is, where? Where would be? Good idea. Steel from chest. Is that the chest I need to plant it in? I could just try all places until I get that weird feeling that I found the correct one. I don't think anybody's home. But best to be absolutely sure. Right, okay, no. Nope. In which case, let's just check the place for useful or valuable items and potential places to plant the object. This is becoming a bit of a tradition, actually, just stealing the sweet roll. Can I not? Oh, it's a candle. Um, yes. Stealing their sweet roll. Immortal blood. Have I read it? I don't think so. Let's take it. You never know. I'd say it was either that dresser or this chest. So let's try placing... It will have come under... Stolen rough garnet, I guess? Yes, okay. I get this strange feeling that that was the right place. Okay, then. One down, one to go. So, do you think I could get away with doing the next one in broad daylight? If I get my timing just right. That would be... And grant peace to these departed souls. Nightshade. Very, very nice. They don't really complain much. That's very nice. Both that you enjoy your job and that the dead are not complaining. I Actually, like more so here. the last. You do not like it here. I'm not that keen on it myself. It, it's a little too... stony. Okay. The milk drinkers in this town will last five minutes in a real battle. Are you going to stand there for long? I'll tell you what, while we're waiting for him to go, why don't we just... Um, check a few things and pick a few flowers. Don't push me, though, dude. This is a delicate job. You're barging around like an elephant on roller skates. Don't ask me what roller skates are. I've no idea. I just, I made the word up. You're doing it again. Okay, let's just pick flowers. 
hopefully we won't look quite as suspicious doing that. He's still there. Okay, look, seriously. Six men, single-handed. I'll rescue my brothers in arms from ambush by an Imperial patrol. That's very nice. I'm not too proud to admit that I need a bit of help from time to time. Okay. If I give you a gold coin, will you go away? Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. Yes, my kind See you around. heart. You should go and spend that coin now. Or you should at least ignore me. Okay? Just ignore me. Come here. Tell you what. I will be here. He's not. He's not looking. He's not actually looking. Let's. Let's. I can do this. I can do this. Yes, I can. Oh God. Oh, you know what? She wasn't in, was she? I think I checked already. Right. Yes. Okay. Um. So you know, I should probably start taking a key mold. I can actually learn how to do that. Then once I've entered, I can always re-enter. Now the curiosity, the 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 question is, where do I place? Oh no no no! I'm not here to plant anything. I'm here to steal. What the hell am I here to actually steal? I'm here to steal. I've done that one. Um, ornate drinking horn. This one, ornate drinking horn. And you know what? Oh. <laughs> you know what? He'll get in trouble after all. Um, there you go. I returned it. Job done. Then I took it. And I don't consider it job undone either. I, I consider it more a separate issue. Please tell me that wasn't somebody walking through the door. She's not here, is she? I do hope not. I not, oh, I can't steal that. No, I can't. Okay. I should probably check upstairs. Now, I should be careful just in case she is home. I did have to uh, pick the lock, which does mean I'm almost certainly going to be pretty unwelcome if she's... Oh, it's a bedpost. I saw a bedpost and thought it was her. Yes, I did. I think I see the thing I'm here to collect. Yes, indeed. I also think I'm alone. Nice! Yes, indeed! We're done! We're actually done! We've got... Okay. Just double check there's no one there before you start prancing around, dancing a jig. Okay, now we can prance around and dance a jig. It's got a certain sort of... Um... I d okay, no, it just looks like I'm being mauled by a bear. I mean, I was trying to say to myself that it looks... Vaguely regal in a primitive, my fortune is a tribal but sort of way. But no, it looks like a bear has passed out in a drunken stupor and is leaning on my shoulders and I'm going to take it home. At least it matches the outfit's colour, I suppose. But it's cold out there and I'm going to need it. Now, unfortunately, Inigo, I'm afraid I only found one. I did look, but I only found one, and, and I figured you do have the advantage over me in the fur department, and it's my money. So that's this how it is. This is where dreams come to die. Let us not draw out our visit any longer than is necessary. Totally agree. We're going to go off somewhere else. Uh, but I do have something for you. 
I must warn you, if you give me a sweet roll, I will make it disappear. Okay, I won't give you a sweet roll. What I want to give you is something to make up for the lack of a cloak. It's an iPad. Oh, okay, yes. Let us get back to it. Oh, yes. Definitely. Very you. Very, very you. And at least your eye is now going to be warm, right? So that's something. I believe all we need to do is follow this road for uh, pretty much as far as it will go until we find a turning off to the right, I think. Let's have a quick check. Yes, turning to the right, and then we just follow that up into the mountain. So it's up there somewhere. Now, I don't know for sure where I'm going to find those boots. Whether they're just going to be lying around. Hlalu. There is a name I've actually heard of. Yes, indeed. That is one of the great houses from uh, Morrowind. Yes, indeed. Okay, we have an abandoned house. Okay. Traitor's post is scum. Hello? Hello? Is there anybody? Th okay. Never mind. Very unfriendly. Uh, I was just going to tell you, I think there's um, a large beast running around. But, you know, you'll figure it out yourself eventually, yes? I wonder what new excitements the rest of the day has planned for us. Yeah. I generally prefer to think of it more as, I wonder what excitements we're... Okay! Uh, right! Yes! Okay! Oh my god, that's a big wolf! Okay! Right. Yeah, now what I was actually going to say is, uh, that I was hoping that we would be the excitement that happened to other people. I suppose that was, uh, me being somewhat hopeful. Right. I'm going to reapply the poison to my sword. So, let's go with the normal one, I suppose. I sold a few of them, actually, to make a bit of money, because the new ones I make are slightly stronger. Yes, they are. And I think I've already poisoned this. Let's just... Yes, that's already poisoned. Okay. So, always be prepared. Okay. What is that? We... Refugees rest. Discovered. Don't mind if I do. Oh. Uh, I've got cold fingers. That's what it is. Cold fingers. Yeah. Ooh. Nice. Double onyx pear silver bracelet. Ooh. I would look good in that. Yes, I would. Let's give that a try. Where was it? Um. Okay. Out of curiosity, that should be on my wrist. I'm not going to be able to see it, am I? Ah, oh, well, never mind. Still, I know it's there. That's the important thing. Actually, that's not true. When I change the outfit, everybody else will know it's there. And that's the important thing. The First Hold Revolt. By, by Mavius C? Sai? Sia? Kia? I don't know. Okay. 
some books, and that was it. Interesting, I guess. Windhelm. Read. Decree of Monument. Fourth Era 20. This tower once served as a meeting place for those brave souls who achieved safe passage to Skyrim. When it brave souls who achieved safe passage to Skyrim would find loved ones and leave notice for others who could not be found. Let it stand in honour of those who had the strength and spirit to accept Skyrim's offer, untithed to any thane or hold, and self-governed with free worship, no compensation to Skyrim or the Empire except as writ of the armistice of old, wheresoever the, those might still apply. And henceforth let no man or mare say that the sons and daughters of Kine are without mercy or honour. We, the Jarls of Skyrim, hereby decree this site as monument to the struggle of those who fled their native home of Morrowind in the time following the Red Year. Okay. Fair enough, I suppose. So. Is this... It's a graveyard. Have I gone too far? Yes, indeed, I have gone slightly too far. I missed the road. I was uh, somewhat distracted. However, I can make poisons with them. So these are graves. I thought that's what that was. It did look like a grave, did it not? Yes, it did. He says, robbing the grave of its flowers. The dead do not need it. No, they do not. Okay, let's go back and find the turning that we missed. It shouldn't be too... F oh, there it is, actually. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, we only just missed it. I, I was so busy. It was the wolves. It was the wolves that distracted us. Otherwise, I would never have missed it, he says, almost missing it once again. Right, so... Now, I'm sort of hoping we're not going to get a hostile reception there. But it did look a little like the gentleman in that building was giving us a bit of a hostile reception, didn't it? So it doesn't look like the people in this neighbourhood are particularly friendly. Yes, I'm now obsessed with snowberry bushes. I should probably stop that. Tell you what, let's let's focus on the fact that there are large wolves ahead of us. And, um, in, in a go. Feel free. Nice. Okay. Oh. Oh. Will not have to worry about being ugly ever again. Nice insult. I like it. Okay. W what time is it? It. 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 Okay. It gets dark around here rather early, doesn't it? And somewhat suddenly. Yeah. Yes, as I was saying, I'll worry about the um, picking of plants and herbs for the way down. Assuming the way down doesn't involve screaming and fleeing and more screaming. Sacculum? of Boethia discovered. Okay. Shall we, uh... Okay, no, there are tents up there. What? Dude, dude, what are you doing? What was that? What was that? Stealth! Oh my god. We'll go this way, shall we? sulking with me because I shouted at him. Okay. Let's just remind ourselves of what we're doing here. We're locating the Daedric Lord's boots for Orion. <sighs> the question is, where will I find them? It does seem... 
like there may be some worshippers around here. Someone has lit the candle. Skooma! Will this help if I give you Skooma? Will you stop goofing off? Hmm? Alright, stay there. I'm, I'm, I'm good with you staying there. I am. Although I might not be. Okay. That looks marginally worrying. As does that. Yes, still worrying. Okay. Alchemy lab. Ritual armor of Boethia. Okay. A warning to those other than the true champion of our Lord Boethia. The diagrams and instructions for forging our sacred ritual armor contained here are only intelligible to her champion, and thus are meaningless to anyone who has n been not been so proven by our dark mistress, the use of unique ceremonial armor has been, long been at the heart of our most guarded secret rituals of Boethia. He who destroys and she who erases. Okay, blah, 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 blah. So this is all about armor. Are these, are these the designs for a good set of armor? Maybe I could sell this to uh, a smith. Okay, dude. What do you need? I am going to give you something. Okay, let's do this quickly and quietly. That was my thinking. Uh, Skooma. Here you go. Following. Yes, now follow in a slightly more chilled and relaxed manner, okay? Not sure what you were doing before. But stop doing it. Follow my lip. Okay. I'm, I'm... I'm seeing an ominous... You're doing this again! I'm seeing an ominous stick sticking out of the centre of the ground. Magic of poison? Oh, okay. And more. Ooh. Not burnt corpses with. What did you do? 